Good morning. Day 11. I spent last night at the Sterling Inn and ate a cheese pizza. <laughs> Just one of the frozen pizzas. And yeah, bathed. <laughs> Um, did laundry again, which felt weird since I just did laundry at Shaw's, but man, I've been so sweaty. And a couple of those stream crossings were mid-thigh, so my shorts were pretty gnarly looking, especially in the muddy ones. Um, so, went ahead and did laundry. My knee feels so much better. I hit it with the trifecta, so I had extra pillows in my bed so I could put that under my knees and some ibuprofen and put on my compression sleeves for my legs. And I woke up this morning with a brand new knee. Uh, had some breakfast and then the inn shuttled myself and another hiker back to the trail where we caught the ferry across the Kennebec River, which the ferry is a little canoe. Um, yeah, I didn't get great pictures of that. I apologize. I am terrible at doing this. <laughs> I, I'll try to get better. So once I started unloading my pack, I realized that I dropped my notebook somewhere just like my little trail log. Huh. I don't know. I had it at Shaw's. But I can't remember if it made it into my pack when I shuttled. I thought it did. So I may have dropped it somewhere along the trail. Which, well, that sucks. So I'll need to jot down the first 10 days as best I can remember while I still can, and then maybe find a journal in another town. Okay, so there's trail propaganda about the goshawk. Uh, there were signs posted back in the 100 mile wilderness for a two mile section about these nesting goshawks. They're birds of prey and have been swooping hikers. Um, I did not see any during my hike that morning, but when I was in Munson at the visitor center, the ranger there mentioned that there are more aggressive ones down this way. And I've heard <laughs> direct stories from individuals that were swooped. Um, yeah, so. I'm now walking through some of that territory and hoping that I'm short enough, small enough to not be seen as a threat <laughs> to these nesting birds because I do not want a bird swooping me today. Oof. Okay, so goshawk propaganda. There's <laughs> trail joke. But it's all propaganda. The goshawks don't exist. Because um, not everyone has seen them, obviously. And, yeah. So that's that. Uh, past three north founders. And none of them had any issues. Didn't see anything. So, yeah. And just half a mile-ish away from the shelter, so... I think I'm good. Yeah, no goshawk today. It is all propaganda. And this, I believe is East Branch Lake, where my midday swim happened. Oh, so lovely. And the trail wraps along that edge. Um, starting at the boardwalk over here. So I'll be heading that way here shortly.
This lake is making it very difficult to go around. Ugh. Y'all, I just saw my first moose. I scared it, actually. I was listening to my podcast and looked up as it ran away. <sighs> Yay! Found one. Day 11. <laughs> I need to be a little bit more aware. I wonder if there's any others out. <sighs> Made it to the campsite. And then it started sprinkling. So I quickly set up my tent in hopefully a place that is not going to get overrun with water in the middle of the night. <sighs> Real bummer. I was originally planning on not putting on the rain fly tonight. <laughs> it was so warm. <laughs> ah, but I'm gonna start dinner. Filter some water, set up my bed. And do it all again tomorrow.